I started as a volunteer at the Good Samaritan Clinic in 1999 and at that time there was a great need in our community for health care for uninsured patients. In 2008, I had the opportunity to come over to the clinic as the Good Samaritan Clinic Executive Director. Um, I was recruited fresh out of school. I had participated in a scholarship um, recipient program through the government and kind of had my choice of clinics to go through throughout the nation. Um, and this clinic just really continued to pursue me and um, was something that I was really interested in because of its ministry and vision and the way that it interacted with its patients. So I kind of had to hold out for a while for approval, but it was definitely worth it. The Good Samaritan Clinic has bridged my faith and my career, and it's been a wonderful change in my life. It's very rewarding working for the Good Samaritan Clinic. I love the patients. We truly care about them here. They, uh, some patients will call us to share good news and bad news with us. Just the other day, a patient called to tell us about his brother-in-law who was diagnosed with cancer and asked us to include him in our prayers. And that speaks to me saying that patients know that we pray for them. They know that we really care about them. And I'm not sure if that happens in other medical practices, but uh, it's really special for us to be included on the uh, celebrations in our patients' lives and um, also to share with the grief and sorrows with them. To me, the Good Samaritan Clinic is my heart. It uh, stands for everything that I believe, and um, every day I get to do God's work. I get to enjoy working with patients and volunteers, people in our community who come in to work. I get to work with a lovely staff that truly has a Christian heart. And every day I get to share lo God's love with someone. Um, maybe it's through sharing in their joys, rejoicing in good news for lab results or some kind of change in their life that has really made an impact. And there are days of great sadness when we have to give bad news. There are days when we have to understand their sorrows and where sometimes more than a hug is needed, more than just um, kind words. And it's at those times when we're able to truly connect with our patients and show the love of Christ with them. And that's the greatest joy. That is the way that Good Samaritan Clinic captures my heart every day. Uh, we act as a primary care clinic, uh, unlike going to the emergency room, having a doctor see you once, prescribe a medication, and never have any follow-up. The people who come to our clinic, uh, we give them quality health care and with dignity. They're treated no differently here and possibly sometimes better than the, a general clinic. Um, we, uh, we follow a patient. We be sure they, they're taking their medications. Uh, we work with them to really get them back into the general population as an integral part. A lot of them are feeling down, depressed, uncared for, and I think uh, once they're established as a patient here that uh, those feelings tend to fade. They begin to feel success. Uh, they get back into the general population, and I think people that have known patients uh, that come here can see differences in them.